Okay, so it's Lily's uh, Moss Out. It's called Lily Miller Moss Out. And uh, that's the product you want to use. Put it into your pump sprayer and you're good to go. I believe it's 8 ounces per gallon, but double check. And uh, that's a lot. It's, it's just uh, 54 ounces, I believe. So it would be 54 ounces, 8 ounces per gallon. That's a lot. It'll last years once you get it all cleaned off. Okay? Anyway, you can do this. Okay, I'll go ahead and show you again how to take the moss off the roof. I took the moss off this roof, as you can see. It's already gone. Now I'm getting ready to put the lilies moss out on it. But I forgot to take a, give you a video of, of uh, how to get it off there. So your best bet is to, um, when you see moss growing, get it, you know, the little tiny balls, you can see them from down below. Little balls of moss, uh, like this. There's little balls everywhere and uh, before you detach them it looks like this you know so it looks like that on your shingles so you want to get a um, right here this is a it's called a um, Stanley Wonder Bar but anything like that's fine something long so you don't have to bend over too damn much but anyway I uh, like that you know, grab it and then use this end here just to light it catch it if it's been raining they come off real easy and just like that and, and cut it all, take them off there. And uh, you don't need to get every part of it because Lily and Moss is going to kill it all. Okay, but you want to get the big stuff off first so it doesn't just dry there and be big giant balls that could create a uh, lift when, uh, when your shingles lift up like this because it's being held up by this big pile here. You want to get rid of that pile. Okay, you don't have to be much. You don't have to do, don't move the shingles too much. Just kind of get it out of the way and the shingle will come back down again when it's hot. So for now, I just want to get as little as you can, just get it, get it off there, get the big balls out of there, and then the lilies moss out will kill it all. Okay? So if you have any questions, let me know, but I'm going to go ahead and spray with lily moss out. I'll show you that in a second. But again, if always, if you have any questions, let me know, and I'll get back to you right away. Uh, you just want to barely touch stuff. Okay? All right, I'll spray it. Again, it could be a big job if you waited too long, but uh, you just want to... Um, get it done one time. Once you do with the little moss out, uh, you'll always be able to just, from then on, just have hardly anything to do. But this is just what happens when you don't use it originally. You have issues you got to deal with. So you got to go around and get them all done. And uh, once you're all done, and then once you put on your lily moss out, and I'll show you that product in a minute, and once you put that on, you won't have to do this anymore. So it's just a one-time affair. You're done and you're left protected from then on out, okay? Okay, when you use the Lily's Moss Out, again, I'll show you the bottle of that in a minute, but when you use that, uh, buy yourself a little one-gallon container like this, one-gallon sprayer, and just write Moss Out on it, and use it uh, every year. Just go up there and spray a little bit, and you're done. That's all you got to do forever, and the thing will last forever. So one little tiny purchase, and you're done. So uh, just get one of these sprayers, pump it up, and you're just going to spray. Um, I'll show you a little bit, but I mean, it's just like any other sprayer, but... You simply take it and spray it on anything uh, It has moss, so especially up on your ridge and all the way around. So you want to spray it wherever there's moss. And uh, on these are the bad sides of the roof, so I'll spray the entire roof uh, just by doing it like this. It doesn't cost hardly anything. Relatively expensive. If you try to use the hose ones, they're a little mess. And it uh, doesn't get nearly a good coverage as thick as it should be as far as I'm concerned. So you just want to simply spray it and uh, get everywhere. Uh, this used to be real bad moss, but I took it all off, so it's looking pretty darn good right now. But once I put this on there, any, no extra moss is going to grow this year anyway. And then every year it just gets less and less. Okay? So that's the ticket. Anyway, if you have any questions, put them down below. I'll show you the lilies moss out here in a second when I get back down to the truck, the product itself. But uh, anyway, real simple, real simple process. Once you do this, you're done. Okay? Look how nice this looks now. Absolutely perfect, okay?